What if the rice bowl in the story of the rolling rice bowl was terrible? Long, long ago, there was an old man who was a woodcutter. One afternoon, the old man opened up the bamboo sheath wrapping to eat the rice bowls his wife had made for him. At that moment, one of the rice bowls fell to the ground and rolled down into a hole nearby. Oh dear, what a waste! said the old man and looked into the hole. Then he heard something from the hole, so he listened to it carefully. What a terrible rice bowl! I have never had such a hard and salty rice bowl in my life. Who on earth put this terrible thing in our hole? We should teach you what the real tasty rice bowl is like. To his surprise, he heard these complaints from the hole. Scared, the old man ran away from the hole, but something was chasing after him. Desperately, he ran into his house, shut the door behind, and told his wife what had happened. Then they heard a voice saying, Was that you that dropped the rice bowl in our hole? They opened the door with fear and found three mice standing there. The old man apologized for having dropped the rice bowl into the hole. And the old woman apologized for having made such a terrible rice bowl. The mice said, We have never had such a terrible rice bowl in our lives. Please let us teach you how to make a tasty rice bowl. The old couple was very surprised to hear that, for they had expected to be scolded by them. Without thinking deeply, they answered, Yes. By all means. From that day, the old man and the old woman began the period of rice bowl training. To make a tasty rice bowl, we should prepare freshly steamed rice. Yes, sir. Also, we need salt, ice water, and a clean cloth. Yes, sir. We got them all. Okay. Now let's get the bowl rolling. First, cool your hands with ice water. Pick up the salt with your three fingers and spread it over your palms. Then, put a lightly filled bowl of steamed rice on your palm and make a rice bowl. Alright? If your hands are cool enough in the ice water, you will be all right to make the rice bowl with just cooked hot rice. However, if you cannot stand the hotness of the rice, you don't have to force yourself. Just put the hot rice on the cutting board or a dish and cool it off a little bit before packing. The old man and the old woman made rice bowls by watching the mice do it. In the beginning, you don't worry about the shape of the rice bowl, but pack the rice gently so that the rice grains cohere. Once the rice comes into one bowl, make an L shape with your right hand and use that to make a triangle. Roll the rice bowl in hand several times, but be careful not to press too hard. The mice move skillfully, explaining the procedure. The old man and the old woman were amazed at them and followed them frantically. Once you pack the rice gently, lay the rice bowl on your hand. Press it gently from top and bottom to make it a nice shape. Now it's done! In a minute, tasty rice bowls were ready. Just one bite of it was enough to know how delicious the rice bowl was. The rice was very fluffy and light with exquisite seasoning. The old man and the old woman wanted many people to enjoy the rice balls. They decided to continue the rice bowl training with the three mice. In the end, 
they open a rice bowl shop. The rice bowl recipe transmitted from the mice to the old couple were so delicious that they became popular instantly. People all over the village came to buy them. Thereafter, the old couple, who had been poor before, became rich and lived happily ever after. The end. <laughs>